totally exhausted. Okay, you guys, so I just, like, randomly decided I'm going to just cut my hair. So, I just got out of the shower, and my hair is really, really wet. So, I was going to be, like, a professional and put the little, like, towel and everything on it. But, I just cut my hair a little bit. It's not much, like, look. It still goes down to at least my shoulder. But, I cut a little bit. I'm so nervous. I actually cut it, and it's kind of scary. I, I cut my hair. It's kind of freaky, but I'll show you the results in just a second. Good morning, Gilly. Good, good morning, Jack. Good morning guys, it is Monday the 19th, it is day 14.54, let's start our vlog by saying I cut my hair last night, and oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, so as you guys know, because I probably added the clips, hopefully, even though I'm a little embarrassed of the clips, because I was trying to be like a professional hairdresser, and so I added a towel, um... So that, like, number one, my hair was really wet. And number two, I wanted to, like, catch all the hair in the towel. But I look really weird in the video, but that's not the point. Anyways, I cut my hair. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. My hair was almost down to my hip before. So if you measure from here to where it is now, uh, yeah. But <laughs> now it's just a little under my shoulders. It is pinned back, just for the record. So, like, I don't know what difference that makes but so it's pinned back a little because it was just a little poofy but it's very curly because I braided it last night and my hair just feels so light and fluffy but that was my first time ever cutting my hair by myself and it freaked me out but I did it and I even cut off the like the ends like the strangly ends I cut those off and um then put it all in one ponytail to try to make sure that it was straight and everything like that and I used a mirror and I took a whole bunch of pictures and oh my gosh so I hope you guys like it and I hope it doesn't look terrible because I don't think it looks terrible but who knows maybe I'm biased I don't know tell me what you guys think of my new haircut in the comments below okay you guys so we I pretty much haven't done really much today besides like a bunch of just work stuff that I just can't really show you and just because it's kind of it's really boring anyway so it's like I can't really show you but also it, I was working on the montage a lot and I don't want to film me working on the montage and do the whole skip up thing because just in case the screen comes into view or anything like that I don't want you guys getting any sneak peeks because I'm so excited for it to come out next Monday don't forget um <laughs> Next Monday, the 26th, day 1461 is our year mark. And we are going to be um, celebrating and having a lot of fun. And we are also going to be releasing the montage on that day. And it's going to be so cool. Now, some of you may have noticed that I released a new intro. And I put it in a couple of vlogs to see if anybody would notice. And a couple of people have. A couple of people have private messaged me and said, I really love your new intro. I'm not sure if you were doing that sneakily, which I kind of was. Um, but that is going to be our brand new intro or a version of that. It's going to be our brand new intro that's going to be coming out for the next year. Now, of course, I'm going to use the other one a lot too. I'm going to switch back and forth. I might just do one this day, one that day this one for a week this one for a week or it might not be that like scheduled but i'm going to switch off between those two and i'm working with a new computer program in order to make a brand new one that's going to be coming out at the end of july beginning of august too so it's going to be really really awesome i am so excited so today officially starts the day that i am cutting back slash quitting soda i have said this in the vlogs before but you guys know that i struggle with it so i'm only gonna drink soda when i go out and by that i mean when i go out to eat i'm going to get soda like 
if I want soda, I'll get soda at dinner if I go out or something like that. Um, and special occasions, things like that. But other than that, I'm going to try to stick to drinking water. Um, if I have a really bad headache or have like a really bad stomach ache, I might drink a soda occasionally, but I'm going to be cutting it back, trying to eat a little healthier, and exercising. I did 1.55 miles today, um, so I'm really excited about that, and I was able to do that in 14 minutes, something like that. So I'm really excited to be able to start that and continue that all through summer, and um, keep it up for a little bit so that next year for a half marathon I can do a better time than I did this year and maybe even a better time than last year too so that was my little thing that I was going to tell you guys but if you guys want to join me on this you totally can and you can put in the comments how you're doing and I'll ask you guys every day how you're doing with your soda and I'll talk about it and all of that stuff and you guys can just do it with me like a community and it'll be awesome Okay, you guys, so you would be so stinking proud of me. Andrew went and he got drinks, okay? So, this is going to look bad initially, but instead of getting a soda like I was going to, normally would going to, I got myself a smart water. And it's got a little fish inside. It says, plant-based, plastic is fantastic. Probably can't see it because it's kind of... But anyways, I'm super proud of myself because I got water instead of getting a soda. Andrew got a soda. He got a cherry soda. My mom has a vanilla Coke from yesterday. I drank my vanilla Coke from yesterday. But today, I'm sticking with water and I've had nothing but water all day. And I'm planning on keeping that up all week because I'm not really going anywhere until Friday. And then Friday, when I go to Burger King, I will have a soda at lunch with Sarah. But besides that, I'm sticking to water. So like I said, only drinking soda okay. when I'm out, like when I'm eating out, which is not gonna be that often, so I'm proud. All right guys, so I guess that <laughs> I made a realization that my hair is probably up a lot because when I came home, and I really thought you would've seen my Facebook page, but that just makes it me realize how much my hair is up to the fact that when I was like, Andrew, what's new about me? He's like, your outfit? And then he's like, your hair. You did something to your hair and like didn't notice it was shorter because to me, it's dramatically short. But I realized my hair must be up in a bun a lot or in a ponytail to which to the point that he doesn't like see it down. So he's just like... What's the difference? Like, I don't see it. So, I think one of my goals for the summer, exercise more, drink less soda, drink more water, have my hair down more, and five, do, like, get out of my comfort zone and do things I'm not necessarily, like, you know, like, that I wanted to do, but that I was always just like, oh, no, I couldn't do something like that. Like, just being more confident in things like that, you know? <laughs> Getting out of my comfort zone a little bit. That's kind of what I want to do, but that's what I realize now, I guess. I guess I need to put my hair down more.